Hey y'all, I am going to start a new series on my thing called um, Shanika Uncut. This is basically <laughs> my life in a whole. Um, y'all like family vlogs and stuff like that, so that's what I'm going to be doing. Y'all, it is 10 o'clock at night over here in Florida. And guess, look at this, look at this. Y'all see this? Y'all see? Hi. Yes. Um, Hi. She's supposed to be asleep. It's 10 o'clock. Y'all, two, a two and a half year old. No joke whatsoever. I know a lot of y'all have been asking me for like family vlogs and stuff like that. And I was like, I don't even know how to start a family vlog. But what I decided to do, y'all, I'm just going to show y'all the honest me. The honest, honest, honest me. Because I am goofy, like very, very goofy. And my life is just like everywhere, honestly. But it's very, you know, to me, I love my life. But anyways, me and this little girl here, I'm going to try and put her to sleep. And yeah, I will see y'all in the morning with this because I'm going to attempt to put the jumping bean. I'm going to attempt to put her to sleep, y'all. So I will see y'all in the morning. Good morning, everyone. I am up, bare face and all. I'm about to go and just um, make my bed and get ready to go and go about my day. Y'all, so what I'm going to do right now, I'm just going to go brush my teeth and start getting my day ready. I will be back. All right, guys, I am back. I'm about to get my teeth brushing on this is my toothpaste that i have using this charcoal toothpaste y'all yeah y'all gotta do y'all know i gotta do my little dance i'm goofy i have been loving this um charcoal toothpaste i'm always using colgate um if you follow me y'all know colgate is one of my favorite um toothpastes so that's how i keep my teeth white so i'm just gonna go ahead and brush my teeth with my charcoal toothpaste you guys and i will be back next what i'm gonna do is just swish around with my listerine you guys and <laughs> I'm so goofy, y'all. And I'll be back to show y'all what I wash my face with. All right, you guys. Today, I'm going to be washing my face with my Koji Berry Soap. I do sell this on my website. My Koji Berry Soap is really good at clearing out blemishes, dark spot, rashes. Um, it helps with acne, scarring, and it leaves your skin, y'all, super, super soft. Today, I'm not using any exfoliating gloves or anything like that. I'm just going to use my hands because Koji Acid, if you guys don't know, has natural exfoliating properties. So, that's why I'm not using it. So, I'm going to go ahead and wash my face and I will be back. All right, you guys, I am going to take my Lemon Dream Face Cream. I absolutely love it, you guys. This stuff is awesome. It gets rid of wrinkles, dark spots, pimples, smooths out, and evens your skin. Um, it's a, a nice little consistency, and that's how much I take. And this is my moisturizer I use on my face, nothing else. <laughs> All right, y'all, I'm back. I done took off my head scarf. Y'all, don't mind my edges. I am growing them back. They are getting thicker because of the oil that I have used. I'm just going to go ahead and oil my scalp as I normally do in the morning. But y'all, y'all see my growth. Y'all see my growth. If you have been following me on my social media, y'all saw when I first got these braids. And this is like, I don't even think three weeks of growth with my hair oil. I sell it on my website, y'all. The link will be down in the bottom bar. All right, you guys, I am back. I am about to go and get my baby ready now. She is in here snoring, y'all. Like, so I'm, I'm done getting ready. And excuse me for the lighting, but my house is not a really bright place in certain areas. Um, But yeah. I'm going to show y'all. She is in here snoring, y'all. The girl is snoring. Hold on. She is gone. Look at the sheet on the bed, y'all. Oh, my God. This girl. Like, and she just... Anyways, I'm going to get her up. Um, I'm about to get her up and get her ready for school. It is cold outside today, you guys. So... Yeah, she she wears a school uniform, so I'm 
I'm gonna have to bundle her up really well because they don't have pants, they don't have shorts, I guess, because we live in Florida, so yeah. So I'm finna get the little jumping bean up and I'm going to get us ready and I will be back. All right, y'all, what I'm gonna do now, I'm just gonna get her hair ready. Y'all seen this spray if y'all follow me in previous videos. So basically what I am just doing is detangling her hair. Because homegirl don't like stuff on her hair at night. And I just left her with her ponytail and help her, you know, not be all uncomfortable at night. So I'm just going to detangle her hair and just put her hair in a ponytail. Going to brush it up and I'm going to be using some extreme gel on her hair. Yes, I use gel on my baby hair. It's perfectly fine. I use it on both of her hair. So I'm going to put it in a ponytail and yeah, get her ready for school. daycare not daycare she don't go to daycare she go to actual school so um interesting story that y'all probably won't even um uh, a lot of y'all don't know because unless y'all follow me on social media she was in like this home daycare type thing for a while because um when they switch when i switched jobs it the schedule that they gave me made it really really difficult because i was working on site so what happens is I was forced to put my baby in like a home daycare. This is a bit of story time. But anyways, I was forced to put my baby in a home daycare. When I say y'all, I cry, I cry. A lot of y'all don't know um, about a situation with me and her original father. That's a, that's a whole nother story time for y'all. So I, I know, like I said, I know y'all like blogs and stuff, vlogs and stuff like that. So I'm gonna try to get these story time vlogs and stuff out for y'all because when I did my poll, that's what y'all said. Like makeup tutorials and family vlogs was the biggest ones. So that's what I'm gonna start trying to get more of out with you all because if you guys have been following me on social media, you notice that um really i haven't been wearing makeup and i haven't really been wearing wigs just mostly my own hair or braids that's just on personal preference it's not that i've gotten away from certain stuff because i still do it's just that convenience of certain things but anyways back to the baby daycare so yeah i had to put her in a home daycare it wasn't bad but y'all i am the most pickiest person y'all probably gonna ever meet and i'm being very honest like the pickiest person that y'all gonna ever ever meet However, and then when I, I got pregnant and, and now I'm a mommy, I am the most paranoid, pickiest mommy ever. So me taking her out of a facility to where she's been since she was about three months in an actual facility, daycare, very, very nice daycare to have to put her in a home daycare, that y'all that just destroyed me i cried like a baby because i was like i don't want to do this but i knew that the job that i was taking would uh, assist us in our life and what we needed at that time so anyway so now she is back in a facility i love it and it's actually a school it's not a daycare so my baby education is very very important to me you guys as most mothers would agree even people who don't have kids would agree my baby's education is extremely important to me and she's two and a half so what she's learning it, hey y'all get it what I'm saying so I don't even have to go into a whole thing but yeah I'm just dropping her off to school right now and her school is not so far from me it's down the street but yeah y'all I am going to come back when I drop her off and stuff like that because sometimes she don't be on it she really don't she be wanting to stay home with me so hope today is monday hopefully today is not one of the days to where she's like uh uh mama i ain't on it and throw a fit <laughs> when we get ready to go drop her or when i get ready to go drop her off to school so yeah you guys and also i work from home you guys well now i work from home um i was at the facility which is why i had to go and be forced to put her into the um home daycare because of the hours and then I was actually on site so right now I'm at home and my husband is 
got a different type of job not a different type of job but a different job so it allows him to be able to pick her up so i was able to put her back in a facility oh i promise y'all god is great when i say god is great god is great because the stress that i was going through having her in that home daycare and then the ladies are traveling um daycare person so it was uh, it's a whole thing okay just imagine the daycare the baby is at the daycare but then when the, the lady have to get up and go wherever it is she going she got to get the kids and go so now the the lady running around with the kids y'all see y'all already know from what i told y'all earlier how that made me feel so i was just and i couldn't it was a whole thing but anyways i'm gonna go drop jelly bean jumping bean aka my sugar pie i'm gonna go drop her off to daycare you guys and i will be back all right y'all so i done dropped the mushkin off and oh my she did not throw a fit so i am super happy about that because home girl i'm telling you when she decide that she don't want to go to daycare and she want to stay with me oh <laughs> She will have a fit, a half, and on some other stuff, and throw it. And I say throw a fit, throw a fit. So, yeah, y'all. I'm about to go home now. Get myself some coffee and get myself ready for work. But, yeah, like I was telling y'all with a regular daycare. You know, I'm super happy that there's a lot of stuff happening right now um, in my life that's allowing me to place my child back in normal situations well not even right now but in general like our lives have been going from everywhere um with getting divorced and being on our own and then me and my husband and y'all story time i got a lot of story times coming for y'all um for y'all that's only if y'all want to hear them so make sure y'all comment down in the bottom bar or bottom box or y'all know that little area make sure y'all comment down there if y'all like these story times or want to see story times or more family vlogs let me know what y'all would like to see and things that you know what y'all want me what type of content basically because me y'all know me of y'all y'all are those who <laughs> have been with me for a while my channel is everywhere there is some literally everything on my channel and the reason why it's some of everything on my channel y'all can see me well the reason why it's some of everything on my channel is because my life is literally everywhere that's just how my life is y'all whatever it is that i feel like or something that i feel like i want to do i go ahead and do it if i want to change my hair i change my hair if i want to change my clothes i change my clothes if i want to move or change my job i just do it same thing with my baby my baby got my same personality the little girl she just likes so many different things so she's into so many different things so you guys Guys who have again been with me for a while it ain't that it's not stable it's very stable my life is very very stable honestly it is just a jumbled organized stuff thing i don't even know how to say it it, it, it is just disorganized but organized it, a disorganized organized situation so that's exactly the best way that i can explain it because i got so much stuff going on so many different things everywhere however it's organized and it, it runs smoothly and a lot of you guys who um probably are like me y'all know that but i started my own business you guys i don't know if y'all seen that that um video but i did i started my own business why because i got tired of working for people so i'm trying to build my business build my brand and stop working for folks i'm being very very honest because it's going to give me that freedom to do what it is that i would like to do with my daughter and us and my husband and us us growing as a family so i started my own business i have a skincare line like I was telling y'all in my other business, I started myself a skincare line. It's called Shanika's Touch of Beauty. I'll post the link to my website down in the bottom bar. Y'all already know. So, but yeah, you guys, I'm just finna uh, go home and start getting my work day ready and I will be back. Hey, y'all, I just thought that I'd come by and just tell y'all while I'm going to get my coffee. Show y'all to get up, to get up, to get up. <laughs> what i got on y'all i work from home so hey this is this is what we rocking with today y'all please ignore my mirror the baby done been on hold to the mirror and she just 
yeah, the baby bit on hold to the mirror. Y'all, if you have toddlers, you know about the struggle of keeping mirrors clean with toddlers, children in general. Anyway, so this is how we styling this morning, you know, getting ready for work. This is how we are looking and styling, you guys. Yes, see the outfit, see the outfit. Y'all see my little messy area over there, the baby bit over there as well. So, back there is just my little area. Like I told you, I started my own business. And to the left of me, might be y'all right, is my work area. But this is my little studio room, y'all. I'm going to give me some coffee. All right, y'all. Coffee on deck. So, okay, I'm going to show y'all the coffee that I got. I don't want to show y'all my little area over here because the baby done been in it. And between my husband and the baby, there is a mess over here that I have to clean up. I'm going to do that when I go on my lunch break. Y'all, a husband and a two and a half year old. Please tell me the difference. <laughs> but anyways, this is the coffee that um I like and my favorite coffee, y'all. I don't know how I got on hold to this. I just saw it in the store one day and I was like, what? So, yes, I drink coffee in the morning for those of you. I drink coffee, tea, whatever it is I feel like drinking. But this is my favorite coffee. But yeah, I normally have like the little K-cups because look, this is my other favorite coffee. It's the Pete's Coffee. That's my other favorite one day in the K-Cups. Normally, these are in, these are in K-Cups, and I normally get the K-Cups. However, story time, when I went to um the store, we went to Target. Because we, y'all, I don't know. I'm, I'm switching places I shop at. Anyways, I'm, so I'm just going to get my little measuring cup here and put it in this little cup, K-Cup thing I got from Walmart. So, anyways, the reason why I got this bag here is because what happened is I went to Target and I was doing my weekend runaround and I was like, okay, I want to get some coffee because we ain't had no more of this coffee. We had other coffee um, here. I even got my husband onto this coffee. Sorry, y'all. I go off topic. Y'all gonna notice that about me um, as y'all see these vlogs. I just be everywhere. But anyways, I got these because I was going to Target to get coffee and K-Cups. Um, not even coffee and K-Cups, but just stuff in general. I'm gonna take y'all with me to Target one day. And they ain't had the K-Cups. So I was like, yeah, I don't like the big things like this. So, but anyways, I was forced to get it basically. And that's how I got this big old bag. And I'm going to use it uh, because I got the big old bag. So, yeah, that's how I got that. But I'm just going to go ahead and put this in my coffee maker. What has my husband done to the coffee bag? Y'all, I'm telling you, a toddler and a husband. Yo, like between the two of them, like... I've I been here going crazy. I ain't going to much lie, but I love them to death. I love them to death. But man, look here, the toddler and the husband. That's all I got to say. And my, um, this is, my husband picked this up. I have never, I've seen the Cinnamon Toast Crunch one, you guys, but I have never actually gotten it myself. But it actually tastes really good. Because I don't like super sweet um type stuff. Normally, I use the, um, it's like a Bridgestone sweet cream one. Um, I normally use in my coffee, but anyways, let me see if I can show y'all what I show y'all all my messiness. But anyways, this is my um coffee maker here. So I just put the Q cup thing, and I use this is so difficult. Sorry y'all, and I use this one right here for my cup. So that's all I'm about to do. So I just go ahead and close it. And with the Q cup thing, you guys, it's like kind of um. With these cucumbers, it's a bit weird when, when you close it. But y'all hear the noise that is the coffee maker. So, I am about to make me some coffee and I will be back with y'all. Alright y'all, so I'm back and that is basically my morning. After I'm done with my coffee, I'm probably just going to go ahead and pick up some of this stuff from the husband and the baby fiasco last night and I go to work you guys so that was my morning i hope you guys enjoyed this video leave down in the bottom bar if you guys want to see more videos and stuff like this don't forget y'all rate comment and subscribe I, I must say doing this vlog was very interesting so i will see you guys in the next one bye